this is your phone battery and as we all know battery has a two chamber that is negative and positive plus <laughs> plus and minus okay and let's see this is your phone this is your phone and there is a co uh, mo no, nowadays most of the phones are using lithium ion or lithium polymer battery and i guess the iphone is using the lithium ion so uh, there is a co ion or electron inside the battery okay uh, so let's say this is the ion or electrons and this ion and the negative sides are pushed to the positive side with a liquid I mean throw a liquid electrolyte solution and when they flows and when they flow from the negative to the positive side it produce energy to your phone and your phone keeps on working and once this flow is over once all the electrons in the negative sides are pushed to the positive sides and when it goes empty your phone battery reaches zero percentage and you know exactly what it will happen your phone will get switched off and charging the battery back up and if you plug in the charger okay if you plug in the charge uh, if you plug in the charger this will push back all the ions in the positive sides to the negative side to with a liquid electrolyte solution and again the phone will get back to the hundred percentage so this is um, a simple trick like I mean a simple way how your phone how your battery works and iPhone used to give uh, like uh, the details of the battery health so why your phone battery health goes down to 90 or 80 or 100 it's because these electrons these electrons inside the battery used to get the match due to heat so i will be explaining how this how this uh, electrons inside the battery used to get the match so watch the video till the end Welcome to Phones and More N07. So today I will be discussing the two points that is uh, what kills your battery and does fast charging affect your uh, battery long term. Yes, what kills your battery? What kills your battery? Heat. Heat is not good for your battery and how heat are produced. So uh, basically the heat are produced uh, due to the like uh, overused overused problem the heat take up produce core and when your phone gets heat up that heat instantly damage the cells inside the battery like i have discussed in like starting starting of the video and when it, uh, it damage your cells your battery uh your battery start draining and the other source that heat up your phone is if you are using iphone 8 and above Truton. I mean, Truton on Corina direct sunlight. Like even if you don't expose your phone like this in sunlight, just put your phone in your pocket or put your phone, put the phone in the bag, and you just keep on walking or riding under the sunlight. Your phone will get heat up. It will not like normal heat all and it will just get heat up, and that heat damage the cell. So I recommend to everyone uh, not to use the Truton or Samsung and Samsung and OnePlus user not to use ambient light 
Ajigali news no Korean Tagiwi because in most part of the India uh, we are experiencing a uh, 43 degree uh, temperature like 43 degree kun bato 45 kun bato 46 tepi jase so temperature kiban high ho wo mon la fon bi inya heat up ho jay so amnyan uh, like you can use the truth on during the winter but like in ajigali summer it's getting extreme so truth on use no korbi and turn on the truth on it will save your battery and fast charging does fast charging charger affect your battery in long term nowadays it's like a fast charger is a kind of race for almost all the smartphone companies uh, just a week back Oppo and OnePlus announced 240 watt charger that will uh, charge your battery from 0 to 100 just in 7 minutes and Xiaomi uh, 12 series they are shipping along with uh, 120 charger and it takes 17 minutes from 0 to 100 so does it does it affect your phone in long term and if it affects then why the smartphone companies keep on manufacturing this fast charger so the answer is yes as well as no why yes Omni like just plug in the charger phone Omni charger plug in Kurubi and if you keep on using the phone while charging your phone will get heat up and when your phone gets heat up it will kill your battery cells and the battery can start draining and also um, if you are that kind of person who used to charge the battery after you get 15% or 10% then you gotta be worried because uh, if you are using a uh, 18 watt, 20 watt, 60 watt charger and if you plug in the charger once your battery gets down below 20% then your phone will instantly get heat up and I'm repeating this again and again and when your phone gets heat up it kills the cells of the ions and the electrons inside the battery so fast charging i recommend as well as i don't recommend i have uh the, I, I have three charger uh the one is 18 watt one is 20 watt and one is uh five watt charger so uh this itula five watt charger to actually temperature issue so during the daytime i don't use this fast charging you know i just use the normal charger even though it takes time uh just say for the safety purpose and right today and during the night i just use 18 or 20 watt charger but most of the time most of uh, the time i use 5 watt charger during the daytime because uh, the temperature is too high and if i use all this uh, 20 watt and 18 watt charger uh, it used to get heat up and the heat is not good for the phone so i don't use uh, these things and if you are that kind of person uh, who keeps operating your phone while charging then i wouldn't recommend you to use the fast charging charger because uh only like phone charge to what that the processor uh that they like hit ek tai wo yeah they uh charging la set the ek tai hit i wo and these two will combine and overheating ho jao and that will instantly kills your battery and you will start facing the battery drainage issue so um, fast charging is recommended as well as not recommended always charge your phone when it's above 20 percentage and don't let it go below 20 percentage and i repeat uh like summer summer that i need to don't uh, iphone users don't use the truton turn off the truton and samsung oneplus user turn off the ambient light and you can just feel the difference after you turn off these things and also iphone users turn off the background app refresh turn off the background app refresh if you if it uh, i mean if you, if you turn off i mean turn on the background app refresh uh, the app will keep on refreshing instantly and it will keep uh, the phone will get heating up even if you don't use so uh, background app refresh of, of code why i'm saying all these things because uh, there's a lot of people who are very much worried about uh, for the batteries mostly iphone users so uh 
अपनी सन लाइट ते वन यू गो टू द सन लाइक आउटडोर दे जाता हूँ दे ऑलवेज टर्न ऑफ द ट्रूथ ऑन एंड डोंट एक्सपोज योर फोन इन सन लाइट डोंट यूज द फोन इफ यू आर यूजिंग डोंट यूज द फोन वेल चार्जिंग इफ यू आर यूजिंग द फास्ट चार्जर इफ यू आर यूजिंग द टाइम ऑफ फाइव फोर चार्जर इट्स ओके यू कैन जस्ट कीप गोइंग विथ इट इवन दो इट टेक्स टाइम इट विल बी गुड फॉर योर फोन एस वेल एस फॉर योर बैटरी इन लॉन्ग टर्म सो आई एम नॉट अस्किंग आई एम नॉट सेइंग डोंट यू फास्ट डोंट यूज फास्ट चार्जर और यूज क्रीडिट भी कॉल आई एम नॉट अस्किंग यू टू यूज एंड आई एम नॉट अस्किंग यू नॉट टू यूज एस वेल यू कैन यूज बट मेक यूज ऑफ इट डोंट लेट इट किल योर फोन एंड Like I have said this earlier as well, so the number of keyboard expertise are much more higher than the number of iPhone in our state. Everyone be like, "Kitiya phone iPhone kinya se," and if the battery health is lower than ninety percent, they be like, "Oh, it's kind of a booby trap for them." They don't care about if uh, the phone has a original battery or not. They don't care about if the phone has a original display or not. But most of the customers, they they only care for the battery. So uh, let me clarify this. I've come across using seventy five percentage uh, iPhone with the seventy five percentage with the uh, uh, the uh, with uh, eighty percentage eighty one percentage. The uh, right now I'm taking this video on iPhone eleven and it has eighty one percentage. And before this, I've been using 11 mean green, and that has a uh, 85 percentage. So I don't see much differences. I don't see much differences. Uh, Apple has claimed that uh, in 800 in 800 cycle, your phone battery health will reach 80 percentage. And yeah, I think that is accurate because one were in the out while our phone run to most of the phone they used to come in like 85 86 or 84 in a large range they i so use iphone 11 hundo so uh, one example of apni uh, you have a car apni la ate kare se and apni gari apni apni la gari te petrol ek liter hali she ko le to apni ni normal normal drive ko shigole to say you are getting uh, ekta i uh, mean one liter of petrol you are getting uh, say 30 kilometers you can cover up 30 kilometers just for the normal drive hole bhi amni amni la gare the petrol ek liter hale ke na ni like gear gear number 1 2 the hale ta there if you keep on driving from there instead of getting 30 kilometers you won't even get 15 kilometers so It's not about the battery health. Yeah, if it's like seventy or below seventy or say seventy two, seventy three, you gotta be worried about it. But if even if it's in seventy five to eighty, it depends on how you use. Just say, uh, some people who play BGMI, they used to bring their iPhone eleven, iPhone twelve Pro. Which are under warranty, say two months warranty left, three months warranty left. But surprisingly, the battery health used to come in eighty, eighty-five, in a large extent. So, uh, it's not about the battery health that show up in the battery setting in the settings. It depends on how you use. It depends on your environment. It depends on what kind of application you are using, like uh, the network band. It depends on everything. Uh, अपने गेम खेला मानो था किसी को जो बोलेगा हंड्रेड हंड्रेड परसेंट भी इट विल नॉट बी सफिशिएंट फॉर यू मतलब इफ यू जस्ट इन नॉर्मल यूजर्स देन एटी परसेंट इफ इट्स अबव एटी परसेंट टेज दैट इज अबव एवरेज एंड यू डोंट हैव टू वरी अबाउट इट इफ द फोन इज जेनुन एंड इफ द फोन इज स्टिल इक्वेप्ड विथ एपल ओ इम देन तरह मन तो कर एक कम ना जस्ट ग्रेट वन सो लाइक गुगुल आर्टिकल समथिंग वगैरह वगैरह तो हम पूरी ना आई रिकमेंड एवरी वन टू एक्सपीरियंस द थिंग प्रैक्टिकली एंड थियोरेटिकली डोंट जस्ट रैंडमली 
read on the Google article and it took up the mindset in a banana. I think that I think that's not good. So, uh, conditioner battery life help to if it's below 80, don't go. If it's below 80, don't buy until and unless the price is good. But if it's 80, 81, 82, 83, if, if, it's, if, uh, if the battery health is between 80 and 85, and if the phone is iPhone XR, iPhone 11, if it's iPhone XR and above, then just close your eyes and get it. You don't have to worry about it. So, um, like I've mixed up all the things, I've mixed up all the things, but Amnian Ekta La Balance Seva Seva DB. And even if I ask you to share the video, if you want to share, you will share. If you don't want, that is up to you. So I give, I give, I give these things to you. It's up to you whether you want to do or you don't want to do. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. And my quality, if I've said anything wrong, today Amnian. Uh, comment section then you drop Korean now more you and also now uh, on whatsapp catalog maintain Korea say all the products which are available in stock uh, we use to upload in whatsapp catalog instantly with the uh, uh, with details and along with the price so uh, my number is my number, uh, my phone number, I will drop in the description box so you can just go and check it out. Uh, check it out. What's uh, what's it? Get yeah, Thank you so much.